Building to a crescendo all week, and very shortly it will be for real. We have... And welcome everyone on what is a perfect day for football here in South London. The venue is Selhurst Park. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Crystal Palace taking on Liverpool. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And I'm hearing that something has happened in the City game. Let's hear all about it from Alex. It's a goal for Leicester City that scored the open up with only four minutes played. Cheers, Alex. Well, the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. A deft clearance. Well, a victory for Liverpool in the last game against Tottenham. How do you think this one will go, Stuart? Yes, their 2-0 victory was fairly comfortable in the end. They certainly controlled most of the possession. And when you look at the two teams today, I'd expect them to win again. They should be too strong for their opponents here. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, here's the replay. Just look at this pass from Salah. And then it's a brilliant finish from Firmino. He just hits it so cleanly. That's a great goal. And the action underway again. The onus very much on Palace to find a response now. Lokonga. Perfectly positioned to take it away. He's in here. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. So back underway following the equaliser. Just the challenge that was required. And beating the defender in with a chance and the keeper has denied it well I've got to say Derek he was always in control of that situation brilliant stuff well he had the reading of that delivery but couldn't find the target will know that the pass needed to be slightly better counter-attacking very much an option well, so many possibilities but it didn't happen for them Nunez Firmino and a very good challenge Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. And unable to keep the ball. Well, I believe a spot kick award in one of the other games. Let's hear all about it from Alex. Yep, it was Arsenal that was awarded the penalty. Luck was on his side today because it... And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Well, it's a great chance here, and don't these fans know it? Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, the keeper had to intervene under a bit of pressure there. Luis Diaz. This attack looks highly promising. Roberto Firmino might fancy this. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, it fizzled out.
Douglas Luiz. Plenty of support here. A fine reading of the situation. And the advantage. Oh, what an opportunity! A lovely attempt. Well, well, well. How many players would have the confidence to try that? Simply magnificent. So there we have it. 2 1. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. But on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Well, it is a booking, and not his first offence. Well, the referee has lost patience with him. He's committed far too many fouls. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Well, there you have it. Liverpool have controlled most of the possession, but their attacking play hasn't been good enough so far. There's been too many safe passes and no real penetration. They certainly need to up the tempo if they're going to get back into this one. Absolutely. And looking to try to take advantage of the possession here. But options at the back post here. Well, it didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done. Couldn't keep the ball. Mo Salah. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Well, very effective goalkeeper. to touch it over and over comes the corner and did his job defensively now counter attacking possibilities here and just one minute of stoppage time say the officials oh big chance oh it looked as though he might be through not so and the referee blows the whistle bringing So underway again, and Palace with the lead, but this game far from being done and dusted. Good technique displayed. He's in with a chance. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Still a chance. Well, they're doing a fine job of applying pressure here, not giving their opponents time to think or get out of their own half. Well, it looks like there's been a goal at the Etihad. Over to Alex for the details. It's a second goal for Manchester City. They're back in this now with 47 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. And Palace will get the throw in. I think we had a feeling this transfer was going to go through. Thomas Lamar has completed his move to Arsenal. Well, at around £45 million, I think they've paid just the right sort of figure for him because on his day, he can be a top-class player. I just hope he proves me right. Just cutting off the supply. Jean-Philippe Mateta. Well, since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. Thiago. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Well, the danger is still there. And in the end, no damage done. Now, interesting developments in the Chelsea game. Let's hear all about it from Alex. Yep, a second goal for the Gunners. They're ahead by two now, with 58 minutes on the clock. Cheers, Alex.
Lokonga. Oh, they have it again. So a half an hour remaining. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. And a useful cross. Well, sadly, too straight to worry the goalkeeper that time. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Crystal Palace facing Nottingham Forest. Splendid tackle and a throw-in coming up. And they're making a change. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. over the touchline for what will be a Palace throw and he's given it away Jota oh fine play this could square the game but the keeper has his say and how important could that be in the grand scheme of things well that was a big chance and really he should have taken that but let's give credit to the goalkeeper it's a decent save and a successful intervention winning the ball back on well, news of a goal in the Chelsea game let's find out all about it shall we from Alex Scott yes it's a goal for Chelsea the goalkeeper has spilled it back into the danger area and he is there to slot the ball into the back of the net nicely They've pulled one back and now trail by one with 68 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. Did well to win the ball back. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Thiago. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. It's got to be! Oh, a goal for Liverpool, who are now on level terms. Well, here we can see just how easily Thiago goes beyond his marker, and then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. 15 minutes left for play. Promising sequence. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, as you can see, he beats the defender so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Well, a goal update for you from the Manchester City game. Let's hear all about it from Alex. It's a goal from Manchester City. It was all in the build-up play for me. So many different players involved. And once the space opened up, he took his chance superbly. They're back in this now. With... Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Well, Alex was in full flight. Alas, we had to cut her off just moments ago. Just a... And still a chance. And they survived the attack. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Well, they know they need to stop him. And let's give credit to the defending. Space afforded him. He could pick out a teammate. And the danger's still on. A really top-notch piece of defending. Encouraging move from Liverpool. Superbly read and executed. And it crossed the byline. A goal kick as a result.